Being a professional musician is based on few things, but one is utterly basic. Before you start meditating, before you start analyzing giant steps, you must first do an instrument. What does it mean? No, 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 no. Let me explain. It means to learn to play mechanically as many combinations of notes as possible. In other words, scales and chords. Sounds boring, I know, but this is material for your music. It's like an alphabet. You must come through it. Unless your only ambition is performance on Good Morning TVN or you want to pretend to be a musician and call your art free jazz. Your choice. It's up to you. How to practice effectively? Everyone has his own way. My method is very schematic. I rely on numbers. If it wasn't that, I wouldn't be sure have I really known the scale. Anyway, let's take the simplest scale. Iona scale. First, you need to stick the scale into your fingers. Use the stopwatch and play the scale forth and back for one hour. And here, important digression, I started to practice like that when I've been playing on guitar for many years, so if you already can play the scale, one hour is enough. The point is, your finger's supposed to play instead of you. You must focus on other stuff. And seriously, you must focus on music while standing on stage. Point two. And now, remember about time? Metronome, please. Play the scale using all intervals. play all exercises through two octaves. I just shorten it now. Now play it again, but change the direction every second interval. Up and down. Up and down. And all intervals again. Up, down. Next, triads. Up direction and down direction. Now, alternately, up and down. Now, passages the same way. Up direction and down direction. Alternately, up and down. When you finish, play all of that again, but now start picking the way up your right hand more freedom later during improvisation. Try to discover your own chord containing three or four notes based on the scale you're just practicing. Try to catch the chord alternating with some chord you know very well. Do it 1000 times. Count and take notes every 100 in order to not to get lost. If it happened, start it again. It's difficult at the beginning, but when you get 8 or 900 your fingers play instead of you. Do next two chords like that. When you did all of that on first position, I mean first fret, I've shown you that on fifth position only as an example, you can write it down. Next, do the same exercises on second fret, first fret, and so on. When you feel dissatisfaction, you can invent few exercises more, like this, for example. You can mark it like that and come through all frets again. Now you can claim you can play Ionian scale and the only thing left is to do the same set of exercises with next modus and ne 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 next modus and with the other scales in general. I don't like to keep rubbish so I always threw away my notes but a few years ago I took a picture for posterity. I like to watch this picture thinking I'm so hardworking person. So this and a few other things require many years spending alone face to face with your guitar. But there is good news, guitar is quite handy, so there is no situation you can't practice. So no excuse and everybody happy, except your neighbors maybe. And you can ask why playing the same set of exercises on every fret is so important, because then your fingers play so many configurations so many times that you can be sure that they are fluent on this particular scale. And you can ask why taking notes is so important, it's psychological approach, you can see your work and you can be sure of your abilities. Ooh, time is over, but let me finish. After all of that, you can finally practice on another field as well, besides you must get that too, that for sure. And jewelry, obviously. Guitarist without jewelry, come on, more jewelry. If you do so, you are finally ready to find a job in music industry. You can share your music with other people, the world is waiting for your talent. It's good to encourage ordinary people in some trick way to listen to you. Hey! 
My drummer is black! You can hire your own manager. If you can't afford this, I advise you to learn sneaky business and propaganda from the best in the world. Although it's also expensive. So my simple advice is just start saving your money. So be aware, you must humbly carry your own gear as a musician and you must be your own driver. But when you start playing concerts on huge festivals for many people, you will be able to, you know, you can finally and ultimately just do things that really matter here. Because be honest, we all know what it's all about.